Hi, I'm Oscar van Deventer and this is the Twister puzzle. Twister is based on uh, uh, Geneva gears of uh, this type. So what you see here is a gear in the middle and if I turn it then we see uh, one gear turning and when I turn it at the other side we see the other gear turning. So when you turn this they turn uh, left, right, left, right. And when I made this uh, mechanism I uh, noticed something interesting. That is instead of driving it from the middle I could also drive it from the sides. So when I'm in the neutral position I can turn this one but then it blocks. But when I'm at this state I can turn the other gear until it blocks again. And then I can turn this one again. So I thought hey this could make uh, a nice puzzle. So Twister is my implementation and uh, here you see uh, the yellow uh, uh, blue. Um, well turn it into the Ukraine flag so you need to turn them uh, all upside down. So um, you can turn one upside down and the, the way that uh, things can turn is only if the full set of adjacent gears allow it. So I can turn now this one, uh, I can turn that one. No I cannot turn it because here they are blocking. But uh, let's see, I can turn this one and then I can turn that one and etc. So the object of the puzzle is to turn them all and uh, you can reconfigure the puzzle because you can uh, have the uh, red gears uh, removed or placed, at a placed differently or maybe instead of having half gears having full gears. But anyway um, even though the prototype is successful it's a failed puzzle because it's not really fun. You just turn uh, each of the uh, discs, you, you try which one can, can you turn, which one can't you turn and at some point in time you uh, try and well there is no backtracking uh, once you uh, get things turning. Um, let's see, I still have this one to do, now I can do that one, that one, that one and we have uh, turned everything upside down. So there was not really a puzzle. And obviously my question to you is uh, this nice gearing concept, how can we turn it into a true puzzle? Thank you for watching.